What is up everybody and welcome back to the last day on Earth survival. So as you can tell by all the dead bodies and the butchered dogs, I've been raided. Let's take a quick look. So yeah, I've got a couple of revenge raid tasks to do. So that means that I get to go out and raid somebody. But to do all of that, I am of course going to need to put on some better armor. Because if I go out like this, I'm going to get completely shredded by everything I come across at the base. So that means a bit better chest piece, is that one good? Yeah, that should be good. And now of course I'm going to need to get my silence guns. You know what, I'm just going to throw all of that away randomly. I know you all hate it, but I can't bother to organise whilst I'm recording. I mean, to be fair, I don't really organise my base that much anyway. But you get my point. And you know what, I haven't got any bandages because I've been making them all for making them all into med kits for the stupid raiders task. And that should be good for metal hatchets. Have I got any... No, I think spare C4's in here. Perfect. Right, now I need some... Just piles of stone. Have I got normal stone brick... Um, actual stones anywhere? I don't think that I do. I can really do with... One thing this game really needs... They could do with adding a search button. So you could just search your base to help horribly unorganized people like me. Hmm. I swear I did have stones. Huh. Oh, I guess we did do, what was it, I think two raids in a row on stream yesterday, so I might have used up a load of stone then. In fact, that is probably what happened. But, just in case, I'll take some stuff with me. And let's go and scout the base. Just work out what they've got. Because, for all I know, we won't even be needing to use any hatchets. Well, obviously we'll need to use some hatchets, but won't be needing to use many hatchets. As it is a revenge raid, it is more likely that it'll, have wor that it'll be a worse base. Right, and let's run that way. Okay, so we've got an airdrop. Bunker resets in four and a half hours. It's currently half past four. I should be streaming at about 8 p.m. And if all goes to plan, this video will go live at exactly 6 p.m. So two hours after this video comes out, I should be streaming. Okay then. Weird that they've still got trees in their base. Hmm. Okay. You know what? Let's go and drop off... How many hatchets have I got? Let's drop off the C4. Leaving that behind, that'll give us two extra slots. And there is an extremely remote chance that this person's hacking because they've got trees. I know it is quite common for them just to spawn randomly on bases. I log into my own base sometimes and I've got trees everywhere. You know what, let's turn on the in-game music. Well, it's not really music, is it? It's more just... There we go. That was a great representation of the music there, wasn't it? Right. And this is... Yeah, this should be probably enough hatchets, I think. Off we go. When the last day, when humanity collapsed, the virus took away 80% of the planet's population. That's rather unfortunate. I think this will use, what... 30 petrol? Oof, 32. I was close. That is quite a lot. That's what, I think, three stacks? Three cans? Something like that. Hey, Bernie. Right then. Hmm. So now, first up, I kind of want to check the chests around the furnaces. Just because they're the most likely ones to have the steel and stuff in. Okay, I'll take that. That's another free hatchet for me. There we go. Two steel. That's what you took from me. I'll take this stuff from you. Perfect. <laughs> I love it. Two steel plates in this kind of pathetic base. And I just saw 14 oak planks there, which, if I'm not mistaken, is an entire wall. Can I? 
There we go. Right, so let's take that and I'll leave all of that for now. Right, so... Okay, this person really does not have much. What have they put in their ATV? Absolutely nothing. Oh, they've put a little bit of stuff in there. I'm hoping the ATV gets added to the game soon. Can I not break this chest because of the damn trees? I think so. Okay. That's a little bit annoying. Hey, four red tickets. I'm happy with that. Can we... Ugh. Inventory is full. I don't want to chop down a tree. Uh, nothing amazing there. I think we're going to be able to open... Yeah, we should be able to open all of this before big one turns up. Oh, and we're getting attacked again. See, raids like this are a little bit on the more boring side. I'm sure they're probably more boring to watch as well. But, I don't know, they're just, they're just a little bit disappointing. Because you don't really do much. It's just standing here, whacking the chests. There's no running around, evading zombies, I don't know, smashing down walls with C4. Hey, I can take that. And you know what? <sighs> Inventory is full, okay. Let's drop off that for a second. How much noise do you think this is going to raise? One noise to break a tree. No, I want to break the box. Eh, nothing too amazing in there either. So is this really everything that we're going to get from this raid? I think it might be. We'll stick a few bits in the chopper. If only these toxic abominations counted towards the raiders' tasks. I mean, I haven't got that task at the moment, but they should do. I think a raid is a pretty dangerous location. Perfect. Okay, and let's go and drop a few bits off in the chopper, I suppose. You could take the steel, you could take the oak, red tickets, and a glock. There we go, and we've still got quite a few storage slots left. Hmm. So now, all we've got to do now is try and decide what loot is actually worth taking, because there's really nothing that amazing here. Hmm. There you go, you can take that. Just trying to maximise absolutely everything. Okay, what we got down here? Uh, don't need any of that. Stones are useful. I'm going to leave that behind. You know what? Let's take... Let's do it like that. And we'll sort out iron things like that. Uh, we'll leave behind the three bits of wood. Doing that now before people can shout at me. I'll take the rope and a load of cloth. Already checked that, it's empty. Beans. I could take this one med kit, there we go. And. Don't really need any of this stuff. That chest is difficult to get to. Uh, See, the rope is nice to have, but I wouldn't take the rope over any of the stuff that we've got. Yeah, I think this might actually be what we're going home with. Hmm. You know what? Let's smash open their workbench, see what's in there. Eh. Yeah, this is a really disappointing raid. I mean, we got two steel, which is nice, but I don't really need steel. I'm dying. You know what? I'm going to eat this person's beans just so I don't have to use any of my own. Nom, 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 nom. Right, well. Hooray for underwhelming raids. Yeah, this is weird that they've still got pretty much all of their trees here. If you didn't raise the noise, I'd be tempted to stay here just to farm the trees. Let's head over to the airdrop and see if we can get a dog there, yeah? There it is. Let's drive over there. And how long have we got? Four and a half hours till the bunker resets. Okay. Come on, give us a doggy. Come on, give us a doggy. Ooh. 
Are we going to get a dog? For some reason, I doubt there's a dog here. Yeah, no doggy. Damn. Well, we can see if we get any red tickets out of this, I suppose. They're always nice to get. No, oh, the bunny's so cute. And uh, a Glock. I'll take that instead of six aluminium. There we go. Yes, I know people are possibly annoyed about me taking a Glock over, well, about me taking aluminium over rope, but I need rope for the spike tasks when I get them so that I don't have to spend as long running around red zones trying to farm rope. Right, back in one sec. Alright, and we're back at the base. Let's take a look at what we got. Yeah, that wasn't... It wasn't too shabby. Definitely not too shabby. Got some pretty decent stuff. In the form of the oak and the steel. And a few bits of copper. Let's go and check how much of this we've actually got now. Because I know our steel stockpile is quite high. There we go. So that's what? 100, 20, 40, 60... Pretty good. 168 steel right there. There we go. Decent amount of brick. You know what? Let's put the stones in here. Ah, copper. Are we actually out of... We are out of room for copper. And this is why I didn't take aluminium. Because I've got all of that. Right. Any room for aluminium plates? Uh, there's 19 there. That's not too bad. Right, let's throw this away. Organise that. Uh, red tickets. I'll take you. You don't go in there. And iron can all go in. Oh. This stuff doesn't belong. Iron can all go in here. And look at that. That's quite nice. Oh, we've got an entire armor set. Does it shuffle that out of order, do you think? Yes, it does. Why does it shuffle it out of order? That's just weird. Alright. So this is a bit of a shorter video today, everybody. I'm going to end it off here. However, I will be streaming about two hours after this comes out doing a live raid and a couple of raiders tasks. So I'll see you all later. Bye!